and we're back with another update on Tuesday's long-awaited system. Early this morning, we can start to see it coming together on satellite imagery across the plains here. Not all that much has changed in our expectations since the last video, but we do have a few more details on timing and snowfall amounts. It appears the most impactful portion of the system will be Tuesday morning for most of us. The first phase of the system will be in the form of snow for those north of I-70. An area of moderate to even heavy snow will develop this evening and push northward, with 1-2 to two inch per hour rates possible for a few hours overnight tonight. While we do expect a bit of a lull just after daybreak, 3-4 to four hours of heavy snow will cause the morning commute to be much slower than usual. Give yourself as much extra time as you can, as roads will be a big mess early on on Tuesday. We expect a general 2-5 to five inches to fall with this first round. But again, most of that will come in just a few hours. As the low pressure center approaches, warmer temperatures will work their way up at the I-55 corridor. This will cause the rain snow line to jump north rather quickly during the morning hours. Dry air will also cause some of the precipitation to erode, and there is some uncertainty on just where the cutoff will be. This should allow for road conditions to be much improved for areas along and southeast of I-55, and the evening commute will be better for those areas. However, road conditions will likely only get worse throughout the day in northwestern Illinois, where snow will be steadier. Later in the day, wraparound snow will filter back in across the remainder of the state, tapering off towards evening. Additional accumulations are most likely further northwest, and there's uncertainty on how fast snow will fill back in closer to the Chicago metro. Combining everything, this is how much we expect to accumulate across the state. The highest amount should end up being further northwest, where snow will last longer. Snow will not last as long across central or even parts of north central Illinois, but it sure will snow heavily for a while tonight. Zooming in a bit, you can get a bit of a better idea where the cutoff between lighter and heavier totals will be. Again, there's still some uncertainty regarding exactly where the rain snow line ends up later tomorrow, so changes are still possible. If you like these maps, check out our Patreon, I'll put the link in the description. So again, expect snow to overspread from southwest to northeast this evening, continuing overnight. This area of snow will be heavy, and an isolated instance of thundersnow is even possible. During the days when things get a bit sloppier, with snow changing the rain for some of us, but snow continuing all day across northwestern Illinois, eventually snow will spread back across most of the state during the evening hours. And if you're underwhelmed by this storm, we are watching a few more. A weak one Wednesday night, and then a potentially stronger one Friday and Saturday. Winter is certainly here. Thanks for watching, be sure to stay tuned for more updates and live streams throughout the event.